Welcome to your challenge with Spirit Tribe Studio. My name is Michelle. Today we'll be doing breath work and pranayama. Find yourself in a comfortable upright seated posture. Feet can be offset. If you can find your lotus or half lotus today, then you are more than welcome to do that. Find a posture that is upright, sits bones grounded into the floor with the top of the head rising up, so a gentle tuck of the chin that you can maintain for the next 15 minutes. So that is the key, is finding that spot that you can find that stillness in body as we look to find the stillness in the mind. Take a couple minutes, find those sits bones. If the hips need to be a little bit elevated off the floor, then roll your mat or find a towel that you can roll or a blanket. If you have blocks, you're more than welcome to use blocks as well. Just find a place where those hips can open a little bit. Begin to gently close the eyes or keep the gaze softened. There's no right or wrong way to keep the eyes other than unfocused to allow that inward movement. Palms can be face down on the knees or face up. You can find a mudra. You can keep the palms right over left, folded in the lap. Again, finding that place for your hands that can remain still for the next 15 minutes keeping the shoulders away from the ears, finding sits bones evenly grounded into the floor, gently tuck the chin, bring the crown of the head up to the sky, lift the heart, and begin to focus in on your breath at the tip of your nose. Inhaling and exhaling through the nose. If that's accessible, if you have a cold, then please do breathe through your mouth. And with your next inhale, from the tip of your nose, trace the inhale in through the nostrils, down the back of the throat, into the lungs, or whatever area you happen to be breathing into right now. Exhaling, gently press the belly button in towards the spine to help press out the breath up back through the lungs, back of the throat, the nostrils, and out of the body again, noticing that exhale at the tip of the nose. Inhaling, trace your inhale, your pace. Notice where you're breathing. No judgment, no changing, just noticing, observing at first, increasing that awareness. Exhaling, trace your breath back out. Grounding with strength and stability in through the body as well. Keep the belly button tight towards the spine and keep the pelvic floor activated. Again, it's going to ground us and keep us stable through our meditation. Still tracing that inhale. Noticing if you're breathing into the chest or the upper shoulder region, sometimes it feels like that's where we breathe. Begin to invite the inhale a little bit lower into the lungs. If you're breathing into the lungs, then invite the inhale lower into the diaphragm area. Only keeping the belly button as activated as you can breathe. So it keeps that stability but it doesn't alter the breath. Exhale, press everything out. With each inhale, recognize the energy and the strength and the life the inhale brings the nourishment. Fill up as much as you can with that inhale. Releasing the belly button. Exhale, press belly button in. 
making room, press out as much as you can to make room. For the next inhale, again, focusing on the inhale, bringing it lower into the body. Release the belly button with each inhale now. Expand that low belly. Bringing in light and nourishment. Exhale, press it away. Press out that which you do not need. The more room we make on our exhale, the more room we have to fill on our inhale. Expand the belly with the inhale. Contract the belly with the exhale. Slowing the inhale to your count of four. Slowing your exhale to your count of six. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, press out, six, five, four, three, two, one. Following your count, inhaling for four. Exhaling for six. Maintaining that awareness on the pace of the breath now. If the mind wanders, bring it back to the pace of the breath. The four count in, the six count out. Releasing the thoughts as they float on by. Either chasing them or pushing them away. Just allow them to float. The mind is a river. Each thought its own canoe. And we can choose whether or not to anchor that canoe or let it float on by. Awareness at the pace of the breath. Four count in, six count out. Maintaining the pace. Begin to bring awareness now to the space between your inhale and exhale. There is a slight pause between each. Just noticing it's there. Noticing that presence of the space between. With that acknowledgement, begin to accentuate the pause at the top of your next inhale, taking in that four count inhale, full and slow. And at the top, gently pause, drink in another sip, pause, and then invite the exhale, press the belly button in towards the spine with the exhale, press out all of that breath. And inhale, at the top of each inhale, pause, drink in a little bit more, one more sip, pause again, and then press the exhale, help it with the belly button. Again, if the mind wanders, let it go. No attachment, no judgment. No chasing, no pushing. Just bring it back to the space between the top of the inhale and the exhale. The next few rounds of breath. Find that space at the top of the inhale, pausing, sipping in, 
pausing and then exhaling. Your next inhale, take it in, pause, sip in some more, make this the biggest sip of the day so far, pause, exhale, next inhale, just allow the pause to happen naturally. Don't accentuate it. And after your exhale, pause before inviting the inhale, making sure the exhale presses out every last drop of breath to make room for the inhale. Pause at the bottom of the exhale. Inhale. Exhale, still the count of six for the exhale. Nice and slow. Slower and longer than the inhale. At the bottom of the exhale, pause. And then inhale. Exhaling. Let the belly button guide the breath out of the body. Bottom of the exhale, pause. Inhale. A few more rounds. Pausing at the bottom of your exhale. Shifting now. The awareness to both the top of the inhale and the bottom of the exhale. Gently pausing at each. So your full round of breath will find pause. That slight breath retention, that pranayama. The top of the inhale and the bottom of the exhale. Again, not changing the pace of the breath at all. Inhale. Pausing at the top. That pause is a reminder of mindfulness of being present. We cannot inhale and exhale at the same time. Exhale. Pause for stillness. Pause for invitation and pause for release. Inhale. Pausing at the top for mindfulness. Exhaling. Pausing for release, pressing out all of what you don't need. The breath is also a wonderful reminder that we take in health, we take in light, we take in life, and we exhale, we release that which we don't need. So those pauses at the top and the bottom of each breath can be a reminder. Inhaling for that mindful, light, exhaling for release. Inhaling that compassion for ourself, that pause at the top. Remind yourself to be kind to yourself. Mindful kindness. Exhale, release. That which does not serve. And the body, the mind, and the spirit. Release the judgment and expectation. Inhale. Pausing for presence. Exhale, pause for release. One more round. Inhale, pause at the top. Take in another sip. Exhale, press out everything you don't need. Pause at the bottom. Finding your natural breath now, your natural pace. Not accentuating the pause, not accentuating the space. But 
acknowledging that that space is always there. Always that reminder. To stay present. To stay kind. To release. Maintain your natural pace of breath. Begin to flutter the eyes open if you have them closed. Or begin to tighten the focus of the gaze if you have your eyes open and soften. Release the hands. Find your knees. Pull the knees together. Nice and slowly. Bring the feet to the floor. Just winch away for the legs a little bit. Coming out of your meditation. Nice and slowly, there's enough abruptness in life that we don't need to come out of our meditations abruptly. Thank you for joining me for your challenge, day 10. It has been my pleasure. Find your breath always, find that space between, and keep that kind reminder to yourself that it's okay to do one thing at a time. And it's actually a healthy thing to do. Inhale, arms up, overhead, look up to the thumbs. Exhaling, bring the palms to heart center. The light in me is connected with and bows to the light in you. Namaste.